Hi everyone, it's Jenny here from Texo. Today I'm answering some of your questions. One common question is, how can I change the limits of my automation? And another is, how do I create variables? So let's dive into the details. First, how to change the limits of your automation. Changing the limits of your automation involves a few simple steps. First, we'll need to navigate to accounts. Go to Accounts and select the social account that you are using for the automation you want to amend, for example, LinkedIn. Navigate to the Limits. You will see an Edit button over here with a pencil. Let's go ahead and click on that. Here you can edit the limits, daily, hourly, etc. Make sure that once you have edited your limits, You hit the save button and that's it my limits are changed now ensure that you are always under the platform's limits or fully understand the changes in limits this option is geared towards our pro texo users or automation experts next i would like to explain to you how to create variables Creating variables is also straightforward. Again, what we will need to do is navigate to Accounts, select the profile that you would like to create variables for, click the Edit button under Variables on that account, and here you can delete or create new variables. Let's go ahead and create a new variable. Hit the New Variable button, then choose your variable name and choose your variable value. Hit save. And just like that, your new variable is saved. Editing variables. To edit a variable, delete it first and then add it again. Let me show you how to do this. For example, I want to delete the variable company Z. What I need to do is delete it first, go ahead and click on the delete button, and then I will add it again. Go ahead and hit the Save button to save your changes. Ensure that the variable name remains the same when you are re-adding it so that all of your automations and workflows using that variable will continue to function smoothly, recognizing the new value. And that's it. Changing the limits of your automation and creating new variables in Texo is simple and easy. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.